I'll tell you guys a quick story, then I gotta get out of here. Thank you uh, for coming out. Um, I love my dad very much. My dad and I are very close. I'm lucky, thank you. I, I'm lucky to have a dad I love so much. He's like a father to me. Like, he's just amazing. <laughs> <laughs> but that being said, one of my most vivid childhood memories was when my dad was teaching me how to ride a bike, which should be a nice childhood memory. Right? Like I would ride the bike and my dad would hold on to the back of the seat and walk next to me so I didn't fall over. And we lived at the top of a hill. <laughs> <laughs> and my dad was like, you should go down the hill. And I was like, I'm scared, dad, what if you let go? And he was like, I'll never let go. <laughs> You're my little girl and I love you. You just go, just go. Yeah. So I went down this hill and I'm barreling down the hill. I look up behind me, my dad's at the top of the hill laughing. Oh, look at her go. Yeah. And I, I crash into this bush and I scratch my knee and my dad had to take me back to the house and put a bandit on my knee. I was crying. And I asked him, I said, dad, why did you do that? And he said, one day you'll understand. Yeah. And two months ago after his knee surgery, when I was pushing him in a wheelchair in a parking garage. <laughs> Thanks. It's like, you're right, Dad. I do understand. <laughs>